Let review new curriculum, Ma PE Majorship, Part 1.3, 50 Actual Let Questions. This is JM Pedagogical Blog, Review, Disclaimer, No Copyright Infringement Intended for Educational Purposes Only. Direction, you may get a piece of paper and a pen to answer. A 20 second timer is allotted for each question. Make sure to answer all the questions honestly, and do not hesitate to finish this video, for you are the next licensed professional teacher. Okay, let's get started. Formative assessment is used to monitor student learning and provide ongoing feedback that can be used by instructors to improve their teaching and by students to improve their learning. It's an integral part of the learning process. Written tests can be part of the assessment in MAPA, Music, Arts, PE, and Health, as they provide a way to evaluate students' theoretical knowledge and understanding of the subject matter. The hamstring muscles are responsible for flexing the knees and extending the hips. These muscles play a crucial role in movements such as walking, running, and jumping. Glow foods are rich in vitamins and minerals that help keep the skin, hair, and eyes healthy, supporting overall wellness and vitality. Setting is the art of passing the ball high and close to the net, allowing the spiker to jump and hit the ball into the opponent's court. The setter skill is crucial for creating strong offensive plays in volleyball. This action, known as a double dribble, is not allowed in basketball. It occurs when a player dribbles, stops, and then resumes dribbling, or when they dribble with both hands simultaneously. Yukioi is a genre of Japanese art that primarily uses woodblock printing. It became popular in the Edo period and often features subjects such as landscapes, historical scenes, and townscapes. It's a fascinating art form that has significantly influenced global art.
A scoring rubric provides clear criteria for evaluating performance, ensuring a more objective and consistent assessment. It outlines specific expectations for different levels of performance, helping to reduce subjective bias. In the confirming step, the teacher provides feedback on the student's performance, evaluating how successful they have been in applying the skills or concepts taught. During a tonic-clonic seizure, it's crucial to ensure the person's airway is clear and loosening tight clothing, especially around the neck, can help. You should also protect their head, move them away from any dangerous objects, and turn them on their side once the seizure stops. Never put anything in their mouth or try to restrain them. Freestyle swimming allows the swimmer to use any stroke, however, the front crawl is the most commonly used stroke in freestyle events because it is the fastest. Running events in track and field are won by the athlete who achieves the fastest time. This includes sprints, middle distance, and long distance races. Preventing a hazardous fall requires constant vigilance, quick reflexes, and the ability to react appropriately in unpredictable situations. It's a critical task that demands a high level of attention and skill to ensure the performer's safety. Modernist architecture is characterized by its simplicity, minimalism, and a focus on function over form. It often features clean lines, open spaces, and a lack of ornamentation. Formative assessment involves continuously monitoring student progress and providing feedback to help improve their performance throughout the learning process. If practice is inversely proportional to the number of mistakes, it means that as practice increases, the number of mistakes decreases, this indicates that the practice was effective in improving performance.
Excessive radiation exposure has delayed effects on the human body. One of the primary effects is nausea and vomiting. It does not directly lead to water pollution, air pollution, or acid rain, but its impact on health can be quite severe. Teaching students to soak their hands or feet in warm water for at least five minutes is important because it softens the nails, making them easier to trim. This practice aids in proper grooming and nail care. Swimming aids can provide a false sense of security. It's important to swim in designated areas, follow safety guidelines, and always be aware of your surroundings to ensure safety. Dietary changes are an essential part of a personal fitness plan and should align with your specific fitness goals. Whether you're looking to build muscle, lose weight, or improve overall health, the right nutrition supports your workout efforts and enhances results. Realism in the arts focuses on an unblemished, naturalistic approach to subject matter, aiming to depict subjects as they are in real life without idealization. Napoleon Abueva is known as the father of modern Filipino sculpture. He received the title of National Artist of the Philippines in 1976 and is celebrated for his innovative use of different materials in his sculptures. A written test is an effective method to assess students' understanding and mastery of the basic food groups, allowing them to demonstrate their knowledge through structured questions and answers. Physical education has roots in the ancient Greek belief in the importance of maintaining a healthy body alongside a healthy mind. This philosophy laid the foundation for physical training and the inclusion of physical education in various cultures.
Using cucumber slices on your eyelids before bedtime helps reduce puffiness. Cucumbers have anti-inflammatory properties and high water content, which can soothe and hydrate the skin around your eyes. The basic movements in the CHA 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 dance involve stepping forward or backward, shifting your weight between your feet, and then performing a quick set of steps. This lively and energetic dance is both fun to watch and perform. In Sepak Takraw, the quadriceps muscle group, located in the front of the thigh, is the primary muscle used when hitting the ball with the thigh. These muscles are essential for extending the knee and generating the force needed for the movement. Value refers to the lightness or darkness of a color, and manipulating it helps create the illusion of depth and realism. It defines light, shadow, and three-dimensionality in art. According to the website of National Commission for Culture and the Arts, on its blog with the title History of Philippine Cinema, the father of Spanish Zazuela in the Philippines is Don Alejandro Cubero. When you engage in philosophical discussions and explore questions about life, reality, religion, and good and evil, you are tapping into existential intelligence. This intelligence involves deep thinking and contemplation about the nature of existence and our place in the world. Physical literacy is more comprehensive, focusing on the development of fundamental movement skills, motor skills, and activity-specific skills that enable an active lifestyle. This holistic approach better equips students to participate in a wide range of physical activities throughout their lives. Rabies post-exposure prophylaxis is necessary if you're bitten by an animal that might carry rabies, including pigs, it's crucial to clean the wound immediately and get a series of rabies vaccinations to prevent the virus.
When two teammates touch the ball simultaneously during a block in volleyball, it only counts as one contact for their team. This rule helps maintain the flow and fairness of the game. After a field goal is scored in basketball, the ball is put back into play from the end line, specifically from behind the baseline. This allows the game to resume quickly and efficiently. Tinalek is a traditional hand-woven fabric made by the Tiboli tribe in South Cotabato. It is crafted from abacar fibers and is known for its intricate designs and patterns, which often have deep cultural and symbolic meanings. This traditional dance is a celebration of community and togetherness, highlighting the strong bonds and cooperative spirit within the tribe. This assessment item directly aligns with the learning outcome as it requires students to actively draw and demonstrate their understanding of the different types of lines. Collaborative health education often includes aspects of food service at the school canteen. Integrating nutrition and healthy eating practices into the curriculum helps reinforce lessons on maintaining a balanced diet and overall well-being, making it a comprehensive approach to health education. An otologist specializes in ear disorders, including issues related to balance and equilibrium. Children who exhibit symptoms like pulling on their ears or balance problems should be referred to an otologist for proper evaluation and treatment. The NBA 3-second rule states that defenders cannot be in the paint for more than 3 seconds in a row unless they are actively guarding an offensive player, and for offensive players cannot remain within the painted area for more than 3 consecutive seconds while their team is in possession of the ball.
push-ups and yoga are strength routines that do not require any equipment. Dumbbells, on the other hand, are a piece of equipment, and dance workouts with videos might involve following a routine but not necessarily focus on strength training. Weiyang is the Javanese term for various types of traditional theatre, including shadow puppetry, Weiyang kulit, and wooden rod puppetry, Weiyang golek. It's a significant part of Javanese culture and artistic expression. The Ablation, a renowned statue at the University of the Philippines, was created by Guillermo Tolentino. This iconic artwork symbolizes selfless offering and dedication to the nation. This assessment requires students to actively engage in a task over a period of time, record their observations, and evaluate their own performance based on specific criteria. It involves practical application and reflection, which is characteristic of a performed task assessment. Tetra pack containers are designed to be recyclable. They are typically made from layers of paperboard, plastic, and aluminum, which can be processed and reused. Having student with sickle cell anemia, here's what to do. Educate yourself, learn about sickle cell anemia, its symptoms, triggers, and treatments to understand what the student might be going through. Create a supportive environment, be mindful of the student's emotional and social needs, ensuring they feel included and supported in the classroom, and monitor physical activities, ensure the student does not engage in strenuous activities that could trigger a sickle cell crisis, provide alternative activities that are less physically demanding. This position involves having the arms at the sides, horizontal, with elbows bent at a right angle, the forearms are parallel to the head, and the palms face inward, forming a reverse T-shape. Establishing specific goals for personal fitness is crucial because your goals determine the types of exercise you should build into your plan, the amount of time you will need to exercise, and any significant dietary changes that may be necessary to achieve those goals.
Creating a three-dimensional artwork through processes such as carving, modeling, assembling, or casting falls under the category of sculpture. This form of visual art involves shaping materials into three-dimensional objects. Before starting any fitness program, it's important to get a physical examination to understand any health concerns or limitations. This helps ensure that your fitness plan is safe and effective. How many correct answers did you get from this review? You may share it on the comment box. I hope you got a passing score of 38 and you learn as well. Good luck LPT cuties, claim it. Thank you for watching and to your dedication. The next video will appear on screen. Click it to watch or you may choose the playlist for more related videos.